Time's up! I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. And I saw these guys running around. And I was like, wait, is this real? You get two questions. How does the snitch work? And how do you fly? Do you fly? Do you, do you fly? You gotta just say, yeah, of course we fly. The people who don't really understand that this is not a joke are the other athletes on campus. I think you meet a lot of people in this world who had dreams and didn't chase them to the end, or maybe you didn't even start chasing them. Here, I feel like we're a family. Like, I could hang out with Quidditch players every day and just be fine. <laughs> We want to compete, and we want to show you that this is real, and we are real. It's really physical sport, like rugby or football. Go, go, go. Oh my god, that was a hit. No one can really call us nerds when we're out there. They do anyway. They do but... anyways. Get us to the World Cup in November in New York City. Our fundraising is slow. The pressure is really intense. Anything permanently derailing the event is terrifying. Bring it up. Where are we? Middlebury College, University of California. Oh, 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 oh. I think we're incredibly discounted being from the West Coast. No one's ever seen us play. I think we could win just because we're going to be the ones that are coming to win. Annual Quidditch World Cup! <laughs> this is happening again. We have 94 teams from 27 states and four nations. Middlebury versus UCLA, possibly the best one of the day. Do not let yourselves get psyched out. It's actually better to be seen as a little weird and to be happy than to not be the person you are.